Okay, let's start here. this. So it transitions as desired. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a recap of composing in pentatonic parallel part 26 micro texts. <clears throat> it took us three sessions to get this completed and we did it. Since the last time we had re-listened we had re-listened to the seven part composition before and after we added what we called micro swells which are volume changes micro lulls which are tempo changes and now in the visualization we wanted to go to uh, micro texts we want to do some more shaping in the dynamics dynamics but for now we're focusing on the animation it keeps us listening as well as looking and thinking so the idea in the micro text is each line of the sonnet was going to get its own text scene. Well, what we actually did over here is each stanza got its own scene. And then we wanted to explore a third scene. So we did separate our text file into the seven stanzas. And we fiddled with using additive dissolve. That was a better way to do it. And we made both a four and a seven text cluster uh, visualization. And we added a new scene to experiment with. So let's show you what those look like. Um, first of all, this is the new playlist where each stanza gets its own scene. So we start out on the 01 Corral scene up here. But then Arpeggios gets a dark background scene then we alternate light, dark, light, dark, light, and then the end scene. And the, the nice thing that we're doing here, let's start at 1017. Let's, let, let's start at illusions, 829. The nice thing that we're doing here is We're leaving a cumulative wake as each stanza gets played and vibrates and is done, it stays static and the next one takes over on the stage. So this is live and everything else is static. scene change. And this takes over. Now it's so loud that it's a solid white. And in order to get these times in here, these exact times down to the fraction of a second, we were able to connect our line diagram, which actually calculates those seconds here under time uh, per bar number, which matches our score over here. For example, bar four here is after 1.75 seconds, blah, blah, blah. And then we were able to use that uh, and, and uh, show uh, here, this is kind of our timing. That's why 142.75 seconds, which the program automatically calculated in two hours, I mean two minutes, 22.8 seconds and so forth. So that that was quite a bit of learning on our part. So ideas for next steps. Um, oh, we'll show you this in a minute. We made a new blood dark scene to experiment with. And we want to start adding subtle cloud effect animations. So let's go over here. Let's turn off the playback control. 
and then let's show you the new scene. So we have a, a sunlit scene that looks like that, a moonlit scene that looks like that, and the one we're experimenting with is called blood dark scene. So the, the clouds are supposed to be in the same position, but we haven't got that figured out just yet. And we're, and we're trying to make them animate. So we're kind of getting that expansion effect, which is based on the volume of the music. So this needs more work. You can see how down here we overlaid things and up here we, well, it's hard to see that, but we overlaid it. Um, so this, this is where we're currently experimenting with about animating the clouds and adding, adding something to the movie besides, or in addition to these, uh, these text things. So why don't we play just a little bit uh, where it transitions dark to light just for fun. And then we'll wrap it up. See the dark? Now, and now that stays put. So that concludes today's stream. Thank you for your time and attention. Look forward to seeing you next time. And remember, the big idea here is we are trying to train ourselves to work with the visual look of the animation, the sound of the song, which can use more shaping and the dynamics and so forth, and even timing it with the ideas, the words that are coming here. We're, we're kind of trying to keep iterating between words and images and sounds and using that to shape the overall composition and the effect and sound cool, look cool, think cool, so to speak. So see you next time. And as always, keep on streaming. <laughs>